What's up guys, Jacob025 again, today I'm going to be doing another video, and this one is not a channel update or anything, it's not like the Godzoo news or like that, but I'm going to be, be telling you guys my um, story, how I became a Godzoo fan, so yeah, I'm going to be telling you a, a story, so yeah, it, how I became a Godzoo fan, I'm going to be putting, I'm going to be putting that in the title, on my channel after this video of course so yeah how i became a godzilla fan well before we go to 2014 the year 2014 um in like 2008 or 9 or 2007 i w i was a big dinosaur fan that day you know us kids us kid yeah us kids when we're younger um <clears throat> we collect dinosaur figures there th those are our first um you know figures to have in your you know in your collection like you know yeah dinosaurs um yeah i love dinosaurs i still collect some dinosaur figures but i have no idea what happened to my dinosaur figures man but you know i have dinosaur books already so yeah but i still collect some dinosaur figures guys don't worry and I'm still finding my my dinosaur figures. I have no idea where it is, but you know, yeah, maybe it's in the attic. I can find it in the attic, but I don't know. But I'll see. I'll look for it. But you know, so yeah, I'm a dinosaur fan. That day, um, I was a dinosaur fan. I'm like I'm like two, three, or four years old. I think I have no idea. I forgot. So, yeah, I was a dinosaur fan. Then after that, like two thousand like nine, two thousand ten, I think like two thousand eight or two thousand seven to two thousand thirteen, I was a dinosaur fan because you know I, I love dinosaurs, guys. But when you no, know, when twenty fourteen, we went to a new. We went to a movie. We went went to the theaters in twenty back in like twenty fourteen. Yeah, back in twenty fourteen. Um. Yeah. Then I think I think we're about to go in in the theaters, or I think we're done. I have no idea. Um. Then I saw this movie, a big movie poster, and it says there. Actually, my dad like found like a big movie poster. It's actually like hanging there like that. <laughs> and my dad said, "Hey, hey, son, look at that. That's like a big, massive figure. I mean, not figure. Why did I say figure? Um, big, massive like dinosaur like thing like that." I said, "Oh, it's a giant lizard. That's how, that's how I call Godzilla that day. God because." That guy called Godzilla a giant lizard because he look he's a big massive lizard. But you know. Yeah. <clears throat> um Yeah, I said, Oh, it's there's the title, Godzilla. And when is it gonna be released? It, May 16th, 2014. I think I'm right. May 16th, 2014. Yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm right. I checked the post over here because I print I printed that poster so it says May 16th, 2014. So, yeah, so it's coming at May 16th, 2014, like this May, I believe that day. Okay, that day. Well, I said, Well, I'm, I'm definitely gonna be watching that because you know, I want to see that day. I said, I think I said this before, I want to see a big dinosaur destroying a city. city. So, yeah, I think I said that. I don't know. I have. I forgot. Okay, guys. But you know. <clears throat> then 2014. Then we watch. Me and my dad watch the movie, which is so cool. Godzilla 2014 is so badass movie. Some people said that the 2014 movie is actually. It's not good. The movie's not good. Some people said, but every. I think some people also said that the movie's pretty good, man. Um. Yeah. That's. That is our first MonsterVerse movie. It, um, yeah, our very first MonsterVerse movie from the from 
from the monsterverse um you know line <laughs> um yeah then yeah then i think after that after like may 16th about like like june i think june or still may i found i went to like a to like a toy store then i found some like some Godzilla figures they're actually bandy creation figures but that i still don't know what kind of brand but you know there's like a lot there's a lot of Godzilla figures there's one that came with a tag like that that there's one that came with the boxes like that man there's a lot of Godzilla figures that day man sadly it there's no more in that toy store so i guess i'm just gonna be finding it in japan so anyways there i found a lot of gods of figures um yeah you, you think i'm going straight to dinosaur to the dinosaur um uh what is what do you call that to the uh dang it i forgot do you think i'm gonna buy some dinosaurs but no I'm looking for Godzilla figures that day. I'm still like six years old or seven years old, I believe. Then <clears throat> I found this. So my very first figure in my collection, which which is which is this guy, the Bent Titan. Sorry guys, somebody called me so yet. <laughs> um yeah, my very first Godzilla figures are these guys, the Bandai Creation Godzilla 2014 figures. I don't know if you can see that, but. Yeah, this is my very first kaiju Godzilla monster. This is my very first Godzilla monster, and this is my very first Godzilla figure. The Bandit Christian Godzilla 2014, Destruct the Destruction City set. I still I still have the the city or actually the buildings in the Golden State Bridge. But I don't know where is my helicopters and jets and like that. So yeah, those are my very first figures. I was about to go with the 6 inch version, but I'm just gonna go with the little tiny one, so yeah. So yeah. Then after that, when I got the, those figures, my second buy, which is the, I think these guys, my very first Ultraman figures. I don't know if you can see that, but here they are. Those are my very first Bandai, like Ultraman figures. Um, yeah. I thought they're, they're, they were Godzilla because they look like Godzilla. They're, they look like Godzilla kaijus that day. So then the second kaiju I just bought that day, I think back like 2015 now, is the Mecha Godzilla 1974, which I got. I bought not the Bandai Creation version. This is the reissue one, the Bandai Movie Monster EX series Mecha Godzilla 1974. The problem is. I have no idea where's the tag of this guy, but you know it doesn't ma really matter. I really don't care. It has a tag or it doesn't have a tag. I bought this figure with the tag, but I even don't know what happened with the tag. So yeah, can I display them? So yeah. Then it goes on and on. Twenty sixteen, I bought some guys with figures again. I don't know which one. I can't even remember them. Even 2017, 2018, I bought Godzilla Monster Plant, though that isn't actually my very first Godzilla Monster Plant figure. 2017, actually, back in 2017 or 2016, I believe, I bought the Bandai Shin Gazo, which is a bootleg one, even the Godzilla Monster Plant, but it doesn't really matter. I'm going to be getting the original ones and the Shin Gazo forms, we getting that soon, even the Servium and other figures that I'm going to be getting in my list. So. Yeah, and then goes on and on. 2020, I bought some figures. And 2021, this is the result, guys. This is my guys' collection. Yeah. I don't know if you can see my collection. It's right in ninth year, so. Yeah. That's my collection. That's how it grew this 2020. I mean, this 2021. So, yeah. So, that's actually my guys. That's actually my story how I became a guys' fan. Some parts in the year like 2016, 2017, keep for, forgetting where I got the Jack specific, where I, what year I got the Jack specific guys of 2014, the Kong one, what else, and other figures. I keep on forgetting when that, when I, what, what year I bought them, so, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I've almost forgot, 
Bandai is actually my childhood figures. Yeah. Bandai. Um, yeah, of course my dinosaur dinosaurs are my childhood um figures, but Bandai is actually my childhood figures. Because when I bought these guys, I immediately bought every guys of figures that I got already. And I still don't have like other figures like the Bandai Mecha King Ghidorah. I still don't have that. The Bandai um Bayonte. That reason I was gonna be getting the Bandai Bayonte, but I, when I saw every like review and boxing of the SH Monsters Bayonte special call version, I want that um destroy. I still don't have a Bandai Burning Gazor. Uh, under six inch bandai figures i still don't have even some eight inch figures starting to collect some eight inch figures so yeah eight inch are cool and even six inch so, yeah. and of course i'm gonna be collecting every neck of every single neck of figures so yeah so that's my story guys i hope you guys enjoyed this remember to subscribe please follow me on my instagram account at jacobs 35 stay big g fans Rawr.